All right, in this video, we're gonna teach you how to tie the bimini twist. This is a knot that is very popular, especially with off offshore fishermen, and I've had some requests on how to tie it. So this video is gonna just teach you how to tie the bimini twist as quickly as possible. All right, so the first step is to just uh, get a loop in your line. Just this is simply a tag in and uh, just create a loop. And what you need to do is make about 20 to 25 wraps or just simple twist in this line. So my left hand uh, is on this side with the loop. So I'm gonna get in there and just start twisting. So we're gonna do this 20 to 25 times. And uh, this is really what, you know, what gets the twist that obviously make up the, the bimini twist. So we're gonna keep on looping around. Well, we're probably about 20 right now. So, uh, so this next step, just to make this as easy and quick as possible, is we need to put this loop on, on a fixed object of some sort. A lot of people use the, the handle of the reel. Since I'm on this chair that has a, a, a handle, I'm gonna put the loop around that and it'll show you how to cinch this down. All right, so we just, uh, we just attached the loop side to the chair, so we have our fixed object. Now we have all these twists just going up the line. They're all going straight up the line. Our next, our job now is to condense, get the, all these twists in the smallest, most condensed space possible. So to do that, we, uh, we grab with one arm, hold on to the main line and pull up. And with the other one, just pull on the tag end at a little bit more than a 90 degree angle. And you can see all those, all those twists are just getting compacted there in that one area. So now with, uh, with the forefinger, uh, you actually put it down in the, in the crevice and, and we're gonna pull up with the, with the forefinger while at the same time lessening the tension on the tag end. And what that's gonna do is that's going to basically just do a doubling over on all those wraps and, all, and go all the way down until you can't do any more. So we're just gonna keep moving up with that forefinger until we get all the way to the very top one. And now at this point we can take our tension off of the main line. So this is our, this is really our bimini twist here. So our next step, our final step is just to lock that into place. So I'm just gonna go ahead and grab it with my fingers so it can't go anywhere. And we now need to make what are called hitch knots. And what that is, is the first one I'm gonna do on this, on this, on the leg that's closest to me, you basically just go around it and then through that loop you just made, you go through it and then, and then pull it all the way up to the top. Another hitch knot on the other leg on the leg that's closest to me or furthest from me closest to the camera so again around it once pull up and the final step is what I used to do is, is just do a double hitch knot around both strands so we're just gonna wrap around and then go through it twice so there's one two so that was again the same same premise just around both strands and doing it twice and then pull forward so that's it so we have our bimini twist now the final step will be just to cut off the tag end and, uh, and as far as uh, attaching to the line, you would then just have this double line to, to tie whatever type of knot you prefer. So anyhow, if you have any questions, please let us know. You can leave a comment down below. Otherwise, we hope you get on the water soon and catch you some big ones.